Now I am going to show you how to update data. In order to update data, here I am going to call public function update. And here in the web.php, I am going to create another route that is update, student update. And here method will be update. So in the update method, what we did in the case of show, I am just going to use the find. So update is very easy. You just have to tell that which data you will update. Just get the ID uh, from there. For example, from my table, if I go here, for example, the number three, I will update. And the is I will make, for example, 30. So if I do that, so I just use the model student and find the ID where ID equal to 3 and here I will update the data. So in order to update the is, I will have to call is equal to, for example, this one I will update to 30. Then just use the single save. This will update or if you want, you can use the update function also. Both will work here. Now if I go into here, and instead of this, I call the update, enter. Now, if I refresh, you will see that the David A's will be changed. So refresh, you see that the A's is now 30. In this way, you can also change other data. And if you do not want to use the find, that is also possible. So in that case, you just can use the where condition. And here, it will be fast. And in the where, you can tell where the id equal to 3. So id equal to 3. So where id equal to 3, in this condition, I will get the first data. That means it will actually return me one particular or one single data. That data, I will just update. This will do the same task. For example, now I go back and make it 28. Same data, I am going to change it 28 now. So I am going to refresh. Now here refresh it. You see that now the A's is 28. Where ID equal to 3. So in this way you can easily update the data.